Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. This video we are going to discuss about the fractions. So, मानो ये सम्स के ने सरे simplification चाहिए आलें टेकन का first of all fractions, decimals and factors and multiples. So, ये three topics कोड़ perfect गोस्ते गन का मानो ये टोन problems है ना easy का solve ही चाहिए जो. So, already मानो माना चाना उनलो factors and multiples already topic complete टाइप है इंदी now discuss about ये fractions. Now, discuss about ये fractions. Suppose, take here 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Here, the given object divided into 7 equal parts. Now, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So, these 7 parts, no, we have to share already 4 parts. Share That's why, this total 7 parts, no, 4 parts. This can be written as 4 by 7. 4 by 7 means total 7 parts low, 4 parts shared chess amount. That's the way here the fraction is a part of a whole or fraction is a part of a collection. And total in the collect chess kuna 7 collect chess kuna. And the in the man shared chess on 4 shared chess amount. That's the way so fraction is a part of a collection or otherwise fraction is a part of a whole. Now here this fraction can be written as 4 by 7. So 4 by 7 in the 4 by 7, 4 is called numerator and 7 is called a denominator. Now here any fractions in the form of the number of the form in the form of a by b. So any number in the form of a by b like 4 by 7 that numbers are called fractions or fractional numbers. Now in this one the a is called numerator and B is called denominator. Now here 4 by 7 is read as 4 sevens. That's why this 4 sevens is a fractional number. Now check name of some fractions. Here 1 half. 1 half means 1 by 2. 1 half means 1 by 2. 1 quarter. 1 quarter means 1 by 4. This is called 1 quarter. 2 thirds. 2 third means 2 by 3. 2 third means 2 by 3. Now 3 fifths means 3 by fifth. Next one 5 eighths. 5 eighths means 5 by 8. So the name of the fraction chala 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 important monkey. In the end, you have a word problem. You have 1 quarter, 2 third, 2 fifth. All I need to do is to compass the fraction. So, and the other names are called. Before already discuss about a fractional is a part of a whole. Now, check how fractional part of a collection. Now, here find the 3 by 4 of 12. Already, man, oh, D mass rule man, no, of means multiplication. Similarly, 3 by 4 of 12 means total total no, 3 by 4 part to enter. That's why. Here 3 by 4 of 12 means 3 by 4 of means into 12. Here numerator 12, denominator 1. Numerator 3, denominator 4. Now these two are cancelled by the 4th table. 4 ones, 4 threes. So 3 into 3, 3 threes are 9. 9 by 1 into 1, 1 means 9. That's the way here 3 by 4 of 12 means 9 parts. Now take under 1, 5 by 8 of 32. 5 by 8 of 32 means 5 by 8 into 32. So 5 by 8 into 32. How many 8s? 8 1s are 8. 8 4s are 32. Now take 4 into 5. 4 5s are 20. That's why here 5 by 8 of 32 means 20 and 3 by 4 of 12 means 9. Now observe one more example. Here, what fraction of an hour is 40 minutes? Now, 40 minutes an hour lo nth fraction of the So now, in this one, the numerator will be 40 minutes. 40 minutes. The denominator will be 1 hour. But in the case of fractions, 
numerator denominator both are in the same units and both are hours long or either both are minutes long that's why one hour converted into minutes so one hour equal to all you know 60 minutes that's why you are 40 minutes by 60 minutes so 0 0 cancel next one 2 2 2 3 so 2 by 3 that's why here what fraction of an hour is 40 minutes means this is 2 by 3 part otherwise 40 by 60 part now observe one more example here 2 by 3 of 27 2 by 3 of 27 means 2 by 3 into 27 now how many 3's 3 1's are how many 3's 9 3's are Subscribe 27 now rest of the yeah, terms so 2 into 9 9 2's are 18 that's why here 2 by 3 of 27 balls means only 18 balls now check representation of a number line of a fractions otherwise number line of a fractions all you know number line of integers suppose suppose it is 0 after 1 2 3 here minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 so on so this is a number line of integers similarly represent 1 by 2 on number line means 1 by 2 means suppose here the first number will be 0 the second number will be 1 so first number will be 0 and second number will be 1 so next one total number divided into how many parts 2 parts so that's mean the 0 to 1 divided into 2 equal parts 2 equal parts first part and second part but you have to collect only one part that's why take this one is 1 by 2 that's why this number or this point indicates the fraction 1 by 2 means 1 by 2 is lies between 0 and 1 now take two more examples of number line of a fractions now take 2 by 3 2 by 3 also lies between 0 and 1 that's why this one is 0 and this one is 1 but here how many parts total 0 to 1 divided into 3 equal parts that's why 3 equal parts so 1 2 and 3 now take only 2 parts first part and second part that's why this point indicate the fraction 2 by 3 so that's why first part second part and third part total divided into three parts you collect only two parts that's why two by three now take one more example three by five three by five represent on a number line this one also lies between zero to one that's the first point zero and the second one will be one so total five parts this total zero to one divided into five equal parts one two three four and five 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. First part, second part, third part, fourth part and fifth part. Now, this number will be 0 by 0 by 5. Now, we are 1 by 5, 2 by 5, 3 by 5, 4 by 5, 5 by 5. 5 by 5 means 1. That's why 3 by 5th part means take this part. This is a 3 by 5th part. What about this one? 1 by 3. 0 by 3, 0 by 3, 1 by 3, this one is 3 by 3, 3 by 3 means 1, that's why it is 2 by 3 and this point is indicates 3 by 5.